Um, Savahra, um, thank you for coming here today at the Aspen Institute. We are here to talk about the German Zeitenwende. And my first question to you is, following Russia's invasion of Ukraine, the Bundestag set up a 100 billion euro special fund for the Bundeswehr. In which divisions of the Bundeswehr do you see the biggest need for investment and why? Thank you very much for having me. First of all, the 100 billion special fund sounds very big at the beginning, but in reality, it's not enough. It's not sufficient. It's not sufficient because number one, it is debt financed, which means that you have to pay interest rates on the Sondervermögen, which reduces it. Number two, we have a very high inflation now. So in real terms, the 100 billion is already less than what's supposed to be when it was started in February. And number three, uh, the uh, 100 billion is based on a deficit analysis, which is two to three years old, and it only addressed shortfalls of equipment. And uh, here comes the point where, where do we need to invest? We need to invest in ammunition because we have a lack of ammunition and we need to invest in future technologies and future capabilities like cyber, like space, like communications. And uh, the, uh, the plans for investing the 100 billion up to now lack that. Thank you. You've already mentioned space as an issue. It's becoming increasingly more important for military operations. What role should space play in uh, security politics and what should the, and how should the Zeitmende reflect that growing relevance? Mm -hmm. If you look what happened in Ukraine, we see that space already today is a decisive military dimension. The war against Ukraine started in space. The day before the ground offensive by the Russian armed forces started, Russia attacked a satellite operator with the goal to cut Ukraine off from uh, the global internet, from connectivity, and limit their capabilities to communicate with their own troops. So we already see, we can see that space already today is a crucial military dimension. And um, thanks to Starlink from Elon Musk, um, um, Ukraine today has the um, um, information and connectivity capabilities they need, the commanders and troops on the ground need, and uh, we don't have something similar. So we need to invest in this kind of field. We need to invest in uh, observation, in communications when it comes to space, and uh, this should play a much bigger role in the Sondervermögen, the special fund, and in future investments of the German armed forces. Thank you so much for your insight. Thank you very much for having me.